So here we have a very simple process and we've already hit the right button, exported the grid and sent it out to Excel. This is the equivalent Excel sheet right here. If I make it a little smaller here you'll see both at the same time. So you can see get part and then the various tasks here. So what we can do is once you have it in Excel you can actually edit it very easily. So you can change descriptives, position to jig, okay, and you might even move items around. So perhaps you come down here and you just take this test item here and we're going to cut it from here and we're going to move it from task 2 into task 3 right here. Paste it right in. Okay, we don't have to remove the blank row if we don't want to. Uh, so we've made some changes to the process in Excel here in the front here. And then all we have to do, if we close the uh, current balance, we can send over the balance again. And remember to select the unit of measure, so we'll call it seconds here. Send it over, give it a couple of seconds. And that information, including the edits you just made, have now been moved around on the chart itself. So again, it's very easy to edit the um, Excel sheet uh, that you've exported to make changes, bring it back in to balance again.